guys welcome back to my youtube channel welcome back to a new video so today we're gonna go and go in with a new makeup look as always and today we're gonna be filming a look with the boxy charm of january that i received if you guys missed on what i got for this month um, go ahead and go into my makeup account, my Instagram, and you guys can see in my highlights, I have everything, um, that I received. So every product that I received, of course, that I could do a makeup look with, I'll be using today. So guys, before we go into the video, um, so I went ahead and asked some people to ask me my Instagram questions on what you guys want me to, like, answer for you guys on this video. So I will be doing that too. I have a few questions that I need to answer, that I need to answer for you guys. So this video is gonna be a little bit more interesting with like so many new things. I'm super excited. This video is, it's like something that I've been wanting to do. Whoa, I love you, man. Like, <laughs> um, so yeah, guys, I'm super, super excited. If you guys can see how happy I am, I am super, super excited for this video. New light, um, new things coming up. 2020 is my year, it's our year, and positive vibes only. So, okay, I'm done talking. That was a long ass intro. First step, as always, we're gonna go in with the primer. Primer is from Smashbox Photo Finish Primer, and you guys already know so far, I'm loving this primer. So, of course, we're gonna go quickly in with the primer. Primer on my face. Now, we're gonna go ahead and go in with our eyebrow you guys already know anastasia beverly hills so and while i'll do my first step or well, my second step i'm gonna go ahead and answer one of the first questions oh Brock. okay so what's the first question uh, okay so shout out to evelyn for asking me questions i love you so one of her questions was, what advice would you give a teenager based on your experiences? <sighs> Bro. Honestly, if I were to like give people like advice, I feel like advice. <laughs> advice, I feel like I would have to do like a whole hour video. But honestly, um, like my best advice I could give a teenager now is just um just live your life like life is too short to like stress on little things like you like sometimes you concentrate so much on the negative that you forget that there's positive things out there also you know um and sometimes you just concentrate on that one negative thought and you're like stressing over that one negative thing going on in your life that you don't realize there's so many other positive things around your life. Like, you don't realize that. You just realize that one negative thing in your life. And you, like, continue your life on that one negative thing. And you're, like, thinking and thinking about, like, all the things that are coming from that negative vibe. That you don't concentrate on the positive things, you know? Like, life is way too short to stress over negative people, negative vibes. Like... Trust me, it takes a while for you to, like, understand that because it takes me, it took me a while and it still takes me, like, a while to understand that negative things will happen in your life. Like, no matter how happy you are, how excited you are about life, no matter how good your life is going right now, negative vibes will always come because as much as you're happy and as much as you're a positive person, there are always negative people around you. Like, there's always that one hater you know what i mean and it's just like if you're gonna always concentrate on that one thing you're not gonna get nowhere literally nowhere like i feel like that's one of the best advice i can give anyone generally i feel like that goes for anyone not just for a teenager now like and generally like i just feel like people just need to stop think about the negative concentrate on the positive and move on because that's that's honestly how life is about like trust me little things that you stress about now later on you're just gonna be like oh why was i stressing over some dumb thing like that 
you'll see it later on when like you things like more important like paying bills um life actual problems come into your life you're gonna be like oh damn like why was i stressing over this when i have this about to stress about so that's you know a bit advice advice i can give someone you know a teenager so yeah guys all right guys so i'm gonna finish my eyebrows off camera and then i'll come back and show you guys, right, guys so next. this is how my eyebrows look you already know flawless but anyways guys if you guys want a separate tutorial on just how to do my eyebrows let me know on the bottom in the comment section so i can like you know just do videos like small videos on like little things that you guys want to see because you know youtube only lets me put 15 minute video so i can in detail more but yeah guys we're gonna go ahead you guys already know my step with my eyebrows um i say more details about that on my first or second video so you guys already know i'm gonna go ahead and do an eyeshadow look with this eyeshadow we received from boxycheck um this is the eyeshadow i have and um i think we're gonna go i think we're gonna go in with this fade color right here pyramid grand canyon and probably a little bit of golden hour we're gonna see we're gonna create a look so while i decide we're gonna answer another question so next one was what's the most important thing in a relationship so honestly that i my personal opinion i feel like communication communication and not only that understanding is one of the most important things in a relationship because if you don't understand yourself and your partner then there's not a per that's not a relationship because in order to be in a relationship you have to understand each other not just he understands you and then you understand yourself you know what i mean like as long as you understand each other and you guys communicate together then i feel like that's the best way to have a good healthy relationship sometimes you can communicate as much as you want but if you don't understand each other where are you guys going honestly that's my honest opinion don't attack me don't say i'm wrong because honestly everyone has an opinion on like different things like you know that's my honest opinion on relationships i just feel like communication and com communication and understanding each other is the way to go for a relationship like as long as you understand me and i understand you and we communicate each other i feel like that's the best way and also your boyfriend or girlfriend has to be your best friend because if that's not your best friend then there's something wrong because honestly my boyfriend's my best friend like he's not just my boyfriend he's my best friend like if I hit him up with like, babe, I got cheese me, it's like, I got cheese me. But like, not even that. It's just like someone that like, you don't just concentrate on like, how do I say? Like, you don't just like think of like, oh my god, I can only talk to him like lovey dovey. Like, like if something's bothering you, like you know, you could talk to him about something that's bothering you from work, school, or whatever. You know, like that's your best friend, the person you like can rely on no matter what happens in life. That's that's what it is like that's that's what a relationship is about like having someone you could rely on and not feeling alone like some people like like you feel alone in a relationship bro then something's wrong in your relationship because you can't be feeling alone when you have someone that's gonna be there that's supposed to be there to support you making sure that you're not alone that you're not feeling that way you know so that honestly is something that I feel like that's the two most important things in a relationship. So yeah, guys. Oh my god, I actually like this color. I actually thought it was gonna be darker than this because look how it looks like right there. And it looks like it kind of doesn't even look brown. It kind of looks purplish. Hmm, this is more interesting than I thought. And I'm just gonna like blend it in very good because I want it to be like dark in the out outer corner and then like towards the inner corner go a little bit light. So I'm going to just be sh um, blending it out really good. Make sure that's blended out. So guys. Alright guys. So this is the outer. The way it's looking. I really like it. Like 
if you guys can see like it's darker in the outer part like i said and the inner part is like mass light guys i keep forgetting to talk in spanish <laughs> i'm sorry Perdón, yo sé que tengo que hablar en español también, pero a veces se me olvida y honestamente, like, no estoy acostumbrada, pero poco a poco va a comenzar a hablar en español también. Um, estamos haciendo un look con la caja de enero que recibí este mes. Hasta mientras estoy así, eh, lo hice más oscurito en la parte de afuera y para más la parte interior lo comencé a hacer un poquito más claro para que no se vea tan oscuro el, la sombra. Entonces, ahora... Vamos a hacer con este de acá. So guys, we're gonna go in with the Grand Canyon. And while I am blending this in, of course guys, do that. Um, while I do that, I'm gonna go ahead and answer another question. And then, um, hold on, okay. So another question is, who inspires you the most? Um, honestly, who inspires you the mo my most is my mother. She's over there. But that's the person that inspires me most because honestly, she has done everything for me and my siblings. Like she's, she's a huge, huge person to me. Like my mom is my everything. And that my mom has been such a big inspiration to me. Like. The days that you, I see myself falling apart, like she's the one there and making sure I'm not giving up, you know, especially the days. There's days that it's so hard, guys. Like, I feel like we all go through those days where ish, life just hits you so hard and you're just like, bro, like you don't want to do anything. Like you just want to give up. But through everything I have put my mom through, because I'm not going to say I'm innocent. I'm not going to say I'm a, the best daughter in the world because I had my days. <laughs> I had my moments. But my mother has, you know, supported me through everything. She's made sure that I never give up my dreams. And, you know, that's an amazing mom to me. She's my biggest inspiration. She's fought for every single one of us, which is me and my siblings. Um, you know, it's hard. You know, immigrant parents are the hardest, I feel like, because they honestly... I feel like they suffered more because you know they left they leave family behind so it's hard for us to you know see my siblings like mostly her but you know i can see my siblings but she can't so it's just really hard but everything she's done to make sure that they're good no matter that they're over there and i'm over here like honestly like my mom's just my biggest inspiration and i'll never ever stop like thanking her for inspiring me to never give up um but yeah that's my that's my everything that's literally my whole everything like i love my mom to death that's that's my best friend too <laughs> my mother's literally my best friend like she like even though you know like i said i'm not gonna act like i'm innocent i've had my days but you know even on the days that i've given her a headache i've never seen her complain about me once so that's honestly my biggest inspiration um but she does watch my youtube videos also so i'll kind of like say everything i just said in spanish so she could understand so la pregunta era i know she's hearing me because she's in my room um quien es mi inspiras quien es la persona que inspiro más so como lo dije pronto la persona que inspiro más es mi mamá porque mi mamá siempre ha demostrado como ser una persona muy fuerte y como ser la persona que like, nunca se da por vencida en los sueños y mi mamá siempre ha sido mi gran apoyo like, siempre busca la manera de cuando yo me estoy cayendo en un Like, cuando me estoy cayendo y siento que no puedo hacer algo, like, ella siempre está ahí apoyándome y asegurándome que no me caiga. And siempre estoy segura que cumpla mis metas que quiero y que busco. Y cuando hay días donde me quiero dar por vencida, siempre está ahí para um, apoyarme y levantarme. Entonces, esa es mi, mi gran inspiración. Ella es la persona con quien admiro más y es la persona más fuerte que conozco. And I love you, mom. So yeah, I know she's hearing me, so it's like, but yeah, guys, that's is some of like my biggest inspiration so far, guys. The eyeshadow look is looking amazing. So back, this is how the eyeshadow is looking so far. I'm loving it so far, so I'm super, super excited. 
you guys already know my inner corners i love doing a little cut crease ow so guys um i just realized that since the video could only be 15 minutes long which i've been saying that for a while now um i'm only i have a lot of questions that i have to answer so so far i've done three i'm gonna do one more and then i'm gonna leave the rest of the questions for next video so i can have more to talk about and then if you guys have any more questions that you guys have then i'll continue doing them for other videos later on with the eyeshadow it's finished i'm loving it so guys next we're gonna go in with the huda beauty and while we go with the huda booty with the beauty we're gonna go in uh with one of the questions that says what three things what's three things that make you happy a lot of things make me happy actually so and like I said, um, wait, I said that in the last video, so, oh, I think I got a lot of foundation. Um, oh my God, this is so cool. So what's three things that make you happy? Um, food, <laughs> clearly. Um, yeah, I love food. Everyone knows that. I mean, who doesn't love food? Um, but there's a lot of things that make me happy. Um, food, my mom, <laughs> and my mans, of course. We're gonna, we're not gonna like, we're not gonna like here. But yeah, I think those are the three main things that make me happy. But of course, I have more. But, you know, my friends, shout out to Betsy, Evelyn, Jocelyn, and Anna. Like, they're the main ones that supported me through all this process of YouTube. Like, honestly, like, there are like the main ones that have support oh my god i look crazy right now but trust the process um they're like the ones that have trusted trusted me there are the ones that have honestly like been there you know making sure i'm like never giving up mm, that making sure that basically that i follow my dreams too like you know that's what you need friends like that that like make sure that they believe on you and believe in you when you don't you know but of course you have to believe in yourself too but honestly they have been such great friends believing in me and pushing me to my limits that sometimes i don't even know the limits that i have so you know i highly appreciate them so i love you guys but yeah um those are three things that i love of course i love my friends too they mean everything to me um what else do i love my family my nephews my nieces I love a lot of people. Um, but yeah, guys, you know, those are three main things, but I love everyone. Everything. I love a lot of things. I love makeup. Everyone should know that, but yeah, guys, I'm definitely gonna, um, oh, I have a pimple. I'm definitely gonna leave the other questions, the rest of the questions for next time, or for like the next video, just because i won't have time to answer them all in one video but hopefully youtube stops acting up and lets me post videos longer than 15 minutes so guys let me just finish blending this all in and then i'll come back and show you guys the next step um i put some concealer on that i got from boxycharm and i'm gonna go ahead and put some baking powder under my eyes and i'm gonna put it on my nose and then we're going to grab some and put them in here. Um, oh, guys, I almost forgot. Lashes. <laughs> We're going to go ahead and put some lashes on. I'm going to show you guys how to put on one of the lashes on one of my, the eyes. And then I'm the, I'll do the other lash. <sighs> camera all right so first um we're gonna go ahead and grab our mascara we're gonna go ahead and grab our mascara and we're gonna just put some on our eyelashes I don't curl them just because my eyelashes are already a little long. So if I curl them, 
it doesn't really like but if you want to go ahead and curl them go ahead make sure you put a little bit not a lot and i like to spread my eyelashes so it looks like that and then of course we're gonna go ahead and grab an eyelash Let's see if this one is for this nose this one's for this eye okay we're gonna grab our eyelash and then we're gonna grab our eyelash okay so now that we waited we're gonna go ahead and grab this and we're gonna go and this is gonna go in right on the eyelash i gotta make sure Since me at the beginning, this is hella hard for me to do it. I mean, this was really hard for me to do it, but sometimes it's even better to do it with your fingers instead of doing it with your the little um the tweezer thing. But to make sure they're in good, I usually grab this and just push. Push them in. Trust me, guys. I still tend to struggle when I do my makeup. Because putting eyelashes is not the easiest thing in the world. Trust me. But trust me. Also, it takes time. Everything takes time and patience. You have patience with yourself to learn. Okay, so this is how I'm looking. All right, so I know I look still a little bit white, but we're gonna go ahead, of course, and with the bronzer, and the bronzer I'm using today is the Babyline City Bronzer in the shade of 100. So, and then we're gonna take one of our, if you guys have been seeing me from the beginning, you guys saw that I received these um, brushes from um, BoxyCharm on my, on my November box. So these are the shades that I'm using. So of course we're gonna go ahead and After I went in with the um, bronzer. We're gonna go ahead and grab another product that I got from uh, BoxyCharm. And this is the blush that we're using. It's called Melted Marble Light um, from Sait London. I'm probably saying it wrong. So we're gonna go ahead and this is how it looks. The apples of your cheeks. Go ahead and do that, and then I'm gonna head and do that and bring some color to your face. And then after that, we're gonna go ahead and grab our highlight and this is another product from um boxy charm that i received is from the becca and the highlighter champagne champagne pop and this is how it looks like it's one of the best highlighters ever i love this highlighter so of course we're gonna go ahead and go in the nose to the uh, tip of the noise nose i'm gonna go in here with the and then we're gonna go ahead and go in right here and just add a little bit right here in the corner of your eyelid. Okay, and that, and now we're gonna go ahead and grab one of our boxy charm that we, one of our products from boxy charm that we received this month. The lipstick is this one. In the shade of thick skin right, guys, so this is like the final look this is how i look up close and honestly i love this look it looks great um the lipstick is like a whole different nude like i didn't expect it because lipstick doesn't i mean it looks like the color i just feel like i thought it was gonna be a little bit darker but i'm actually really liking this lip color so guys 
What do you guys think also, about this look? Like I said in my last video, we are having a 100 follower giveaway on my Instagram. Uh, we're having a makeup giveaway. I am 14 followers away from getting 100 followers. So if you guys want to go ahead and follow me on my Instagram, I'm going to put that all the link on the description box. Um, Just because, hey, who does want to have a giveaway? Like, who does want to get free makeup? I do, but it's not for me. It's for you guys. So I am doing that giveaway once I hit 100 followers on my makeup um, account. So definitely, guys, go check that out. And I always be like making polls and see what you guys want to see the next time, new videos and everything. So guys, like I said, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And guys, I'll see you in the next video. And the next video is going to be for a Valentine's look. That is, Valentine's is 12 days away. So don't miss out. All right, guys. I love you guys. And I'll see you in the next time. Bye.